morning. It's Terry Dwayne Ashford. We're coming in with you. We're going live, live, live with you right now at 1213 p.m. And we are live with you in Washington, D.C., bringing you the report, the police audio that we promised you for today. Today is February 28th, and it's Sunday, and we are presenting this report to you right now from Street Now News. I'm Terry Dwayne Ashford, your journalist and chief broadcaster. I'm also, you're in the car, see that guy starting right now. In the day in which we will release the portions of the audio recordings that mainly released version as well as the version that's coming from Terry Dwayne Ashford Street Now News Jack today. Our release for today will be minimum because of pertinence and relevance. Based on facts shown Regarding abuse of the badge, the authority of the badge by the officer who instructed, who gave instructions that was intended to set up, frame, sabotage, and entrap the victim. Terry Dwayne Ash for Street Now News found a full release of the audio. It's not even pertinent. It's not even important. Because what you will hear in the full range report by Terry Dwayne Ashford, the video or the recording would be simply the second leg of officers doing an investigation of something that they already knew. What you would be seeing is a second phase of the abuse without seeing the first phase of the abuse. So releasing the audio would be showing you something that is not even pertinent. Therefore, we're not releasing, we're only releasing the fact that we have it in full version. We're only releasing the part that shows that we have audio recordings of the investigation that would seem, that would seem to be accurate. But it is as inaccurate as the ones who are planning that particular investigation are the ones who all so manipulated the registration that they're investigating. So they are investigating something that they already know. And that investigation was set up by even another Washington, D.C. Metropolitan Police Officer abuse of abusing the authority of the badge. The victim was instructed under the badge of law to move his vehicle by an officer, a police officer, that particular police officer sat right there as the other six officers came around. A plan, a plan that has been sniped. A plan that appears to be coming out of 4D. A plan that will end in a poor D, a 4D officer down and going to Acrotrass. I'm Terry Dwayne Ashford, upcoming next is the report that we plan to release. Terry Dwayne Ashford here, and we are discussing um, the release of the audio from the detainment on February that occurred to Terry Dwayne Ashford on February the 26th. And what we have to say about that is we are releasing a very, very, very minimal portion only to show that we do have it's not even pertinent it's not even important and the reason why it's not important is because one those officers should not have surrounded or anyone in that particular matter after an officer with them that was sitting out there had just instructed to move the car this particular officer instructed me to move the car and this officer then waited six of them come to say now you're driving the car well the officer right there just told me to move it I'm expecting this officer to come and say well I just told him to move it the the officer sit back there and watched the officer that instructed me to move the car sit right back there and watched right with him he was one of the six cars so I have decided to either to release a extremely, extremely minimal portion, only to show that we have the information so that we have to handle the situation in court. We can handle the situation in court. But you, 
those six officers are illegal, illegally rushed and bomb rushed Terry Dwayne Ashford because one, they were with the officer who told me to move. The officer gave an instruction. He gave an instruction with the intention to cause harm to the person whom he was given the instructions to. The officer gave an instruction under trust and the person trusted him and moved and the officer was sitting right there. For everyone to know that was within right seconds. There. Wasn't even minutes. Because that is seconds. ridiculous. You don't tell me that. It's not ridiculous. You don't tell me that. Terry Dwayne Ashford here reports for you. We're only releasing the minimal because it really doesn't even matter what was said. Because we already have what was done because we have the documentation and we also have the fact. Yeah, the fact that an officer instructed me to move and that officer was there, was there when six other officers pulled up and that officer said absolutely nothing, sat right there and watched. Terry Dwayne Ashford reports live for you. We're getting your report this morning from Terry Dwayne Ashford, February the 28th, Sunday. It's now 12, 20, and this is your sixth live reporting from Street Now News. Jack Terry Dwayne Ashford in the day in which we will release the portions of the audio recordings that may have already been released. And that is the reason why we place distance and time between the two versions. We may have an illegally released version as well as the version that's coming from Terry Dwayne Ashford Street Now News Jack today. Our release for today will be minimum because of pertinence and relevance. Based on facts shown regarding abuse of the badge, the authority of the badge by the officer who instructed, who gave instructions that was intended to set up, frame, sabotage, and entrap the victim. Terry Dwayne Ash for Street Now News found a full release of the audio. It's not even pertinent. It's not even important. Because what you will hear in the full range report by Terry Dwayne Ashford, the video or the recording would be simply the second leg of officers doing an investigation on something that they already knew. What you will be seeing is a second phase of the abuse without seeing the first phase of the abuse. So releasing the audio would be showing you something that is not even pertinent. Therefore, we're not releasing, we're only releasing the fact that we have it. In full version, we're only releasing the part that shows that we have audio recordings of the investigation that would have seen, that would seem to be accurate. But it is as inaccurate as the ones who are planning that particular investigation are the ones who all so manipulated the registration that they're investigating. So they are investigating something that they already know. And that investigation was set up by even another Washington, D.C. Metropolitan Police Officer abuse of abusing the authority of the badge. The victim was instructed under the badge of law to move his vehicle by an officer, a police officer. That particular police officer sat right there as the other six officers came around. A plan, a plan that has been sniped. A plan that appears to be coming out of 4D. A plan that will end in a poor D, a 4D officer down and going to Acrotrass. I'm Terry Dwayne Ashford. Upcoming next is the report that we plan to release. Terry Dwayne Ashford here, and we are discussing um, the release of the audio from the detainment on February that occurred to Terry Dwayne Ashford on February the 26th. And what we have to say about that is we are releasing a very, very, very minimal portion only to show that we do have, it's not even pertinent, 
it's not even important. And the reason why it's not important is because, one, those officers should not have surrounded or anyone in that particular matter after an officer with them that was sitting out there had just instructed to move the car. This particular officer instructed me to move the car and this officer then waited, six of them, to come to say, now you're driving the car. Well, the officer right there just told me to move it. I'm expecting this officer to come and say, well, I just told him to move it. The, the officer sit back there and watched. The officer that instructed me to move the car sit right back there and watched right with him. He was one of the six cars. So I have decided to either to release an extremely, extremely minimal portion only to show that we have the information so that we have to handle the situation in court. We can handle the situation in court. But you, those six officers are illegal, illegally rushed and bomb rushed Terry Dwayne Ashford because one, they were with the officer who told me to move. officer gave an instruction. He gave an instruction with the intention to cause harm to the person whom he was giving the instructions to. The officer gave an instruction under trust and the person trusted him and moved and the officer was sitting right there. For everyone to know that was within right seconds. There wasn't even minutes. That is seconds. ridiculous. You don't tell me that it's not ridiculous. You don't tell me that. Terry Dwayne Ashford here reports for you. We're only releasing the minimal because it really doesn't even matter what was said. Because we already have what was done because we have the documentation and we also have the fact. Yeah, the fact that an officer instructed me to move and that officer was there. Was there when six other officers pulled up. And that officer said absolutely nothing, sat right there and watched. Terry Dwayne Ashford reports live for you. Let us also remind you that there is a federal case in the U.S. District Court that's instructing the Washington, D.C. Metropolitan Police officers to stay away from Terry Dwayne Ashford. And you are still in violation of that federal, yeah, that federal case. By even bothering me, you are in violation of that. Do you... Do you not understand that? Yes or no? You have a problem. You do have problems. And as a result, I, Terry Dwayne Nash, as a result of the um, documentation and also the facts regarding how it all occurred, we've decided to release only a minimum portion because it doesn't even matter. It appears that the police officers were doing investigation and the seconds of the audio that should not have even uh, been there the that will place. be that is released so is only not even to show about that we have the audio. Said. We already, already had what was done. We it's already have how it was done. to release the audio. Why? The fact that yes. an officer in matter in which the police officers to move that officer sat right with the they had one first place. Seven approached it illegally dropped up six damn officers in charge. Six of right and one officer Terry Dwayne came over approached and requested the person to move. That officer sat right there and watched the six drive up. Sat right there and said absolutely nothing. That is fucking ridiculous. And that is also corruption. Just in case you don't know, we do know that. For Street Now News, I'm Terry Dwayne Ashford. The stressful situation that we're mentioning there is one that you, the officers, were intending and in trying to sabotage and terrorize an innocent person. That's what you were doing. We're going to leave it at that. It didn't even matter what was said because you were investigating something that you already knew because you was the one that did it. Yeah, I, I just don't like... Allege. I mean, I'm, I'm already in a very, very stressful situation. No, I understand that. And, and been in a very, very stressful situation. So, bro, when did you buy the car? Yeah. Uh, 2019. You didn't buy it, 2019. And it was around. Did, where did you buy it from? It was 